Thank you for joining this lesson. We're going to discuss physics paper one, number 12. A YouTube containing mercury is used as a manometer to measure the pressure of a gas in a container. When the manometer has been connected and the tap opened, the mercury in the YouTube settles as shown in the diagram below. So we are having the tap here for the gas. We are having a mercury in a manometer, a YouTube manometer for this case. Then we are told if the atmospheric pressure is 760 millimeters of mercury and the density of mercury is 13,600 kilograms per meter cubed, calculate the pressure of the gas in pascals. Remember to subscribe to this channel and to also share the link with friends. Let me start by noting that if we let the right hand side of this youtube manometer to be side b then the left hand side to be side a for liquids and fluids generally we usually say that a pressure at the same level is usually equal therefore i'll be very right to say that pressure at a is equivalent to the pressure at b and now Pressure at A is a pressure due to the mercury height plus a pressure due to the gas, while the pressure at B is equal to pressure due to the mercury height on side B plus pressure due to the atmosphere. Now with this, we can say that a pressure due to mercury, this is a on side A that is, this is a 10 centimeters of mercury. Let me first use centimeters of mercury plus the unknown pressure of the gas. This should be the same as pressure of mercury on the other side, which is a 8 centimeters of mercury plus pressure due to atmosphere which is given as 760 millimeters of mercury, but this can be converted into 76 centimeters of mercury. Now with this, pressure of the gas can easily be obtained. When we take, when we take 76 plus eight minus 10, 76 plus eight minus 10, then we're going to get 74 centimeters of mercury. We should now get back to our question and discover that we've been told to calculate the pressure of the gas in pascals. For us to convert pressure into pascals, then now we can get to the formula and say that a pressure in liquids is usually given by H rho times G. Therefore, the height of pressure, which is equivalent to pressure of the gas, is 74 centimeters of mercury. So we can divide by 100 to make it as a unit, that is the meter, multiplied by 13,600, the density of mercury, multiplied by G, which is equivalent to 10. Therefore, now, when we multiply all this, we're going to take 74 over 100, multiplied by 13,600, multiplied by 10, and this is going to give us exactly 1,640, 1,640 pascal or pascals. So this will be the, this will be the amount of pressure of the gas in the above manometer.